Hey everybody, what is going on? Pete Simonet here for NYY News. Want to talk about Oswald Peraza getting the call up. If you guys follow me on the NYY News, the Simonetti Source channel, you would have already saw the video I made, the Pinstripe Prospect Weekly video I made on um, Oswald Peraza to know a little more about him. Peraza is in AA right now doing tremendous things. The Yankees, I believe... On MLB.com, the number four prospect overall, but he's right up there with um, your elites in the Yankees system, Anthony Volpe, Jason Dominguez, uh, those type of guys. He's right up there with them as one of the best offensive talents the Yankees have in the minor league system right now. Estevan Floriel is also getting the call up. Now, before we all get too excited and start jumping around and, and praising the praises of, hey, look, they're giving him a chance. He's getting called up as part of the taxi squad, and that basically means for the game tomorrow, which is the Field of Dreams game, where I am actually going to be live. So remember, if you do not follow the NYY News of Simonetti Source channel, go do that because you can actually watch the game with me live, get your questions answered. It's always a good time. Most of you probably already know, but Oswald Peraza is going to be up. Now, some people also said that maybe this means that Glaber Torres' injury is a little more serious than believed. Well, we're also told today by Aaron Boone after the Yankees got the victory today in KC that Glaber's feeling a little better already. He got a little boo-boo on his hand, on his thumb. You know, he can't play the Nintendo Switch that much anymore. So, you know, he's 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 working on, on, on getting back on the field. But is there a possibility Peraza stays around? Maybe. Does he even start tomorrow? I hope so. I mean, if, if, if you're going to have the kid up, why wouldn't you, you start him in a game? He's already up there. Start him in a game. Uh, maybe they see it as a backup, but it, it's a great time for, you know, the coaching staff to see how he reacts to this to this level. Is he ready? I know everything I hear, and I've been told, and this again has been on the page a lot on the Twitter, of course, is that Oswald Peraza, the bat, is ready. They know the bat can play at this level or higher levels. Again, never played in AAA yet. The fielding is not a problem. He's a smooth defensive fielder. The idea of it is, where is he going to play? Is it going to be as short? Is it going to be at second? Is it going to be at third? Good thing is, he is such a good athlete that he very well could play any of those positions. He also got terrific speed. He also got power. Um, this guy's able to, to drive the ball out to right center field, right field down the line. He got power to do that. That's the type of kid we're looking at here in Oswald Peraza. I've been a huge fan of him. You guys, again, have seen my videos, know what a fan I am. On Twitter, I've talked about him multiple times. Him and Anthony Volpe are right there hand-in-hand hand as, as, as two of the top infield prospects. Definitely the Yankees have had in a very, very long time. No doubt about it. I'm sure they could find room for both of these guys, but it's exciting right now to see that Peraza is getting up. He is on a 40-man roster. So he'll get that little taxi call up, they call it, because typically it means you're up and then you go. But we'll see what happens, right? Um, We'll, we'll see what happens for, for Oswald if he gets the shot to even play, which would be absolutely awesome. Your first major league game, you get a call up and you're playing at the Field of Dreams game. That is so damn cool. So maybe that'll be what happens. Maybe it won't be. But then also Estevan Floriel is getting the call up. Lance Lynn is going to be pitching, so maybe... Florio gets to start, probably not. It'll probably be Brett Gardner, but Florio will be there also for this game. So maybe a good little thing for our younger guys. I still think Florio should be the starting center fielder, but that's just me. A lot of people bring up, well, the AAA numbers. Well, look at the major league numbers. Those are pretty damn good. So again, guys, tomorrow, 7 p.m., I am going to go live at about 645 Make sure you check it out. Watch the game with me. Get your questions in there. But again, for NYY News, I am Pete Simonetti. You guys are the best. Thank you so much for watching.